but what is especially uh -uh, uh -uh. <laughs> we're not making up words today like we're not highly educated <laughs> Hey guys, Nikki here. It's been a minute since we've talked about fragrances and I am ready. I got a plethora of cheap, no I ain't gonna say that, inexpensive bum fragrances to show you guys. Get ready to tap, tap, tap. I will link them all below, of course. Most of them are Amazon scents. And I will link them right here below the video. And as I talk about them, if I can and if they are available on YouTube shopping. All right. So if y'all want to hear about these bum fragrances, let's get straight to it. I know it's been a minute, but we always start these videos out with dossier they sponsor all of my fragrance videos so that is what we are going to talk about first so dossier is a brand that sell inspired by fragrances that are inspired by some of our favorite niche designer brands the bottle start at 29 dollars a bottle i do have a discount code so of course dossier will be the first brand link below the video because they are sponsoring me okay so let me just show you what i got this round they do sell more than fragrances but Anything that has to do with fragrance is probably over there for a fraction of the price. So let's just go into what I got. So I'm going to start with what I'm most excited about because this is new to me. They just start making it in this scent and it is my favorite scent from them. It is called Ambery Saffron and it is inspired by none other than Baccarat. So this is the box right here. Here's the card that come in the box. It's a Ambery Saffron with all of the notes. And this is a diffuser. Now, look like a little bit of my oil spill, but that's okay. Guys, I love these diffusers so much. Here's your oil and here are your reeds that you stick in here. I'm not going to open this one yet because I do have like quite a bit throughout my house that I just opened. But I'm super excited because this is a new fragrance. And I said, Dossier, you know we need these diffusers in Ambery Saffron and Kaboom. Ask for it, you shall have it. <laughs> so they sell candles as well. And this is a big boy, a big, big boy. Look how beautiful and chic that is. Look how big that is, okay? So I love their candles. Mm, they are two wick candles and they are bum. So this one right here is Floral Rose and it is inspired by Le Labo Rose 31. I do not own any Le Labo scents, but this smells really good. It's a really, really, really good rose scent. It's fresh, what is in this? Top Nose Rose, Cumin, mmm, Better Beer, Incense, Cedarwood, Must, Citrus, Amber. That's a beautiful rose scent, guys. So let me just show you the other candles I got. Ambery Vanilla, which is inspired by YSL Black Opium. Aromatic Star Anise, which is inspired by Dior Sauvage. This is the strongest one. If you are that person that loves that strong scent to cover certain smells in your house, I ain't gonna say, okay, this is what you need. <laughs> and the last candle is Floral Marshmallow, which is inspired by Love Don't Be Shy. I love this as a bedroom scent because it's so soft and girly and don't get so strong. Beautiful scent in a candle. So that's the candles. And then I was sent three fragrances. So let's talk about them. Correction two. So all of their fragrances come in a box like this. And everything is in here like a card telling you all about the notes and etc. So this is 1.7 fluid ounce. The top is magnetic. I love their packaging because it's so sleek. And their best sellers, which is Ambery Saffron, Ambery Vanilla, and Floral Marshmallow, is available in a big bottle. Um, so you can get more because I run through these things so fast. If you watch me, you know I do. So this is Fruity Gardenia, which is inspired by Gucci gorgeous gardenia which i do have but i will tell you right now the gucci brand the scent don't last i don't know what that's about so this is what it is inspired by right here and i will just tell you right now i absolutely love the scent of this but it don't last it's here for a good time not a long time all right so this right here i'm super excited about because dossier fragrances last on me all day so I'm so, ooh, that smells so freaking good, guys. I'm going to try not to spray every time I say something smell good because y'all know I will. Y'all know I will. <laughs> 
So they also have their own fragrances that will come in a reddish orange box like this. This is called their Originals. And let me just show you this one right here. This is called, this is from one of their collections called the Wedding Collection. So this one is called Neroli Romance and it's not inspired by anything. So I'm just gonna spray the car and give you my opinion on it. So let's see what's in here. Neroli, salted caramel, hazelnut, orange flower, lavender, violet, patchouli, better beer, vanilla, and, and broxton. The scent family is gourmand and floral. It's spicy. It's really, really spicy. It's a good scent. It is kind of spicy though. So if I was walking in the mall, would I just grab this and buy it? I don't think I would. But it's something for everybody, okay? So I will leave Dossier link below. Make sure you check them out. Obviously, they have some of everything over there. Let's move into the rest of the video. All right, let's get into some Amazon scents, guys. This is $53 on Amazon. Where I got it from, it was like 30 something. I will link where I go get a lot of my Amazon scents locally. Um, but I know a lot of you guys who watch me aren't local, so this is an Amazon video, okay? So this is called Toast Love Me, and I've never even heard of this. This is the bottle right here. It's black and silver. Let me tell you guys the note. I'm trying notes. I'm trying to be a little bit more prepared because my last one, y'all said I was all over the place. But yeah, when I talk about fragrances, it's coming from somebody who just likes to smell good, not a frag head, not somebody in the fragrance community. So I can't even go deep into the notes and stuff. I can just tell you if I like it, where I would wear it what it reminds me of what it smell like that type of vibe all right so on amazon this say it is a flory oriental and fruity fragrance hazelnut grapefruit peony black orchid vanilla that be sandalwood okay so i don't know what this would smell like i just know it smells really really good like in comparison to something and it's so sweet and good what i really really it has to, I, I'm finding out that I am a vanilla person though. I am a vanilla person. So if you see this somewhere or if you're at the classic wholesale store I go to, if you want to pay the $50 off Amazon, snag it up. I'm not going to talk too much about it because it's not really what this video is about because you can find that brand in Macy's and stuff and we're focusing on like Amazon since today. Well, besides Dossier, but you get what I'm saying. So let me quit talking and move over to Batik Aroma Concepts. This is the box right here. I saw Fumi Monet talking about this, right? So let me see how much it is right now. That last spray, when I sprayed it, it went all over my finger and it smells so freaking good. This smells so freaking good. Oh my God. Jeez. Okay, so yeah. Paris Corner Boutique Watermelon Perfume. And it's that simple. It is, which bottle is this? The 3.4 is $32. Or you can get a 1.7 for $23, okay? $32, guys. And it's just, it has a 5% off coupon right now. So let me tell you why I love this. Because it is straight what it say it is. Watermelon. If you are a watermelon type girl, you will love this. But what is especially... Uh-uh! Uh-uh! <laughs> We're not making up words today. Like, we're not highly educated. I mean, I might act a little slow, but baby girl is degreed up, okay? But what I really like about this is the fact that it's just straight no chaser. You say watermelon, and that's what you're going to get. When I smell this, here's the bottle, by the way. It is glass that is metal, because sometimes that stuff be plastic. I think... It, it's nostalgic. It takes me back to high school because I smell watermelon Jolly Rancher. I smell watermelon Blow Pop. Just straight watermelon. But it's not like bath and body work. That's strange. It's like a grown and sexy watermelon. But what I like, <coughs> what I like about it is if I have on something that's too serious, that's what I call it. Spray a little bit of this and it'll tone it down. Like say for instance, if I have ooh sad mood, but it's during the daytime, Put a little splash of this on it to like fruit, like get to like give it a fruit smell and not make it seem so nighttime ish, date night ish. If they get what if y'all get where I'm going with that, I ain't gotta explain too much, all right? 30 dollars, y'all. 30 dollars. 
add to your cart and what I like to say when I do these videos all the time is like you literally can go on Amazon and fill your whole entire cart and pay less than what you would pay for a bottle of Baccarat a bottle of whatever like a bottle some designer you know what i'm saying and these are great fragrances they are great don't sleep on them just because they're inexpensive especially the ones that um are middle eastern y'all want to get into it let's go so guys if you watch and love me you know who's first up on the list latafa renee smith okay <laughs> So Latafa, I think I only have one thing from Latafa, so let's just go ahead and get them out the way. I really, let me tell you, let me show y'all why I got this. Hold on. So I'm just cruising, 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 and they're like, it's a new Latafa out. Um, it has a light up box, and I'm like, a light up box? So let me tell you where they were going with this box. This box is so heavy. This is Tiziana Terenzi Talia. We all know you open it. There's a light. It has a little runway right here. This box is so heavy and it smells so good. Talia smells so good. So Latapa said we want in on the little pizzazz of it too, right? So this is the box right here. This is called Amir. This was only 30 something dollars, guys. And you open it up and it lights up too. Like what, Latapa? Alright, so let me let me do my homework real quick. I'll be right back. 31 dollars on amazon right now so i showed you guys the bottle i mean i showed you guys the box let's get into the bottle this is the bottle right here it's gold this is plastic but it looks very high end all right so let's talk about a mirror like i said it's 31 dollars right now and what is in a mirror juniper berries sage bergamot lemon white tea patchouli cashmere cedarwood is suitable for daytime wear now the first thing that i get when i spray this is lemon i, I have a cousin who loves lemon fragrances she would love this and i honestly might give it to her i honestly might yes mm, maybe not <laughs> maybe not the lemon the citrus the lemon in this is very prominent i i, I think this is trying to smell like another Tiziana Terenzi scent that I used to have that come in the same bottle as Talia but um I don't have it anymore so I can't compare it Talia was $675 this is $31 job and I promise you Latapa go last Latapa go project Latapa go smell good and it's gonna do what it needs to do okay so I did a little cheat over here guys and it's online it's saying it don't have a clone it's its own thing but if you love a lemon woodsy like vibe if you just love this bottle if you just love that light up box 31 dollars grab it okay next up is another middle eastern brand i am starting to love when the person sold me this their exact words were they said look Tafa was getting all the money and they said no we want some of it too. The oils are more concentrated, a little bit more than Latafa. It's just Latafa is the talk of the town right now. And this bread is called Luniche or Luniche. I don't know. Lou something, okay? And they not they not playing with us. So I am gonna show you a few fragrances from them and um then we'll move into Miss Armoff. Alright, guys, like I said, I got three different bottles. These might not be on Amazon. So, but I do have somewhere else I can link them, which is called Jomo Shop. You might not get them as fast, but you'll get them, okay? Okay, so this first one right here is called Fustac. Fustac. This beautiful green box. And on the their website, it's um, $70, but I found it somewhere else for y'all for like $30, girl. Okay, let's start here. The notes are sweet almonds, pistachio, peony pear, floral peach, vanilla woody gourmand tonka. So when they showed me this in the store, I instantly fell in love because that's like all of my favorite. Everything I love. I love vanilla. I love peach. I love almond. It, it just, it just was screaming to me. So this is the bottle right here. Very cute bottle. Has a little rhinestone up top. All right. So this right here 
It's so freaking soft and sensual. It screams pretty sweet girl, okay? It screams the girl at school everybody used to love because she was just the sweetest. Me. It screams um just the sweet girl at church to me. It's very light and airy, but it packs a punch. It is so good. The pistachio is very prominent in here. And let me see where I find it. I found it for you guys on Jumo Shop for $32. So it will be linked below. If you want to compare that. If you want to compare that to something, I wouldn't compare it to Kylie's pistachio, whatever it's called, because I didn't like that. But I do see it being in the same family as Final Refragrance Pistachio. Please, just lighter and airier. This is way stronger than the Lunisha one I showed you guys, but it, it will kind of be, but it's kind of in the same family if you get where I'm going. So I'm not going to lie, this one I did have a hard time finding. Maybe by the time this video go live, it, I will find it somewhere, but it is called Hoffa. And this is the box right here. So Hoffa is actually more masculine, which is a shocker for me because I usually don't get down like that, baby. I'm a big grown woman and that's what I like to smell like. So this one has mint, apple, lemon, tonka bean, aproxen, amproxen, geranium, Girl, cedar, cedar, bit of your oak moss. It has all of that. Now, let me tell you why I got this one. This is roughly like $30 as well. Here we have our bottle right here. Okay, there's the bottle. This is the male version of another Luniche fragrance I already showed you guys called Aziza. So, Aziza is giving very herbal pure. Okay, so I will link this one as well, but we're not talking about this today because we talked about it in another video. But uh, but if you are a person that loves Herba Pura but feel like it's too feminine or you love Herba Pura and would like to see how it smells on your man or something like that, that's where this mug right here come in. Y'all know I don't do masculine. They said smell this, sis, and I got it. Mmm. been swallowed put this on this smells so dang good oh my gosh hoffa helpful that's what it should be called okay get it for you or your boo because i can see both of y'all wearing it don't show no bottle get your own okay get your own yeah so this is so this is another new one it's so new i can't even find it on google y'all I'm going to find it for y'all though because y'all need this. Okay. Mine's still in the packaging. Well, this is called Karaz. And it's made by Lunish as well, I think. Chai, is it? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm having vision problems today. Yeah, menopause, menopause. So, this has cherry, red fruits, divana, rose, sandalwood, ooh, vanilla in it. All right. If you know those notes, you already know what this is about to smell like. But let me just show y'all the bottle. This is the bottle right here. This is in the $30 range, $20, $30 range as well. <sighs> yeah. They said, this is new. This is new. And they like, hey, I could be on a commercial. Hold on. Okay. They love when I come in and they like test me and they like, what you think this smell like? What you and I nail it every time because who you think you're playing with, my boy? So anyway, this is Karaz and it smells just like Tom Ford Lodge Cherry. Now you guys know, okay, how I feel about Tom Ford Lodge Cherry is the exact same way I feel about something else I was talking about. It ain't lasting. You spray it and you gotta respray it probably every two hours. It's not beast mode, but I love this cherry fragrance. I love it to pieces. Like I just love it on me. This is exactly that, and I guarantee you it's gonna give it a this gonna last two, this gonna last three, four, because the oils in here are just so prominent because they're Middle Eastern. I hope I'm saying that right, or they're Arabian type, or like hands down the best type of oils and stuff. So Mm hmm Mama got to find this for y'all because it smells too good. Do you understand me? Let's move on. Oh, last. I got six bottles from a brand new... Well, it's not brand new. It kind of is, okay? So, if you're familiar with Armav, they have untold 
Club de Mouet. Those are like the first Arabian scents that we fell in love with or Middle Eastern scents we fell in love with. They came out with a line specifically for females. So Ermoth is unisex. This line is called Miss Ermoth. So these are targeted for women. These are on Amazon. I'm super excited about that. So let's just hop straight into them. Straight into them. <laughs> Stop what you're doing. And tell me thank you in the comments. Because y'all, as you can see, I love me some expensive perfume. But y'all also know that I overspray and go through bottles of perfume like it's crazy. Y'all just be amazed at how I have so much perfume and still go through so much. So tell me thank you in the comments because I'll be hooking y'all up. Alright, I'll be hooking y'all up. So we're gonna start with attitude. So I showed this in a vlog. This is the box right here. Kind of has the drip effect. Yeah, I told y'all when I was in the store and I was smelling these, they all ran together, baby, except one or two. But um, yeah, this is the box right here. Just a regular degler, nothing to call home to mom about type box, okay? The bottles give so cute. So I'm just going to show it to you from back here so you guys can see the full effect. Like I said, this is Attitude. Oh, that's such a pretty rose gold um, copper type bottle, okay? So what I was saying about this, I'm going to have my phone because I, you know, I didn't take notes, child. Y'all going to forgive me. Okay, so this is $38 on Amazon. The notes in this one is almond, rose, jasmine, bergamot, tuberose, coffee, orange blossom, tonka bean, sandalwood, amber, cedar. Okay, so I'm just going to tell y'all right now, Miss Armoff or Armoff showed out with this whole entire collection. And for them to be in the $30 range... They like showed out, they last, they smell good. Every single last one of them smell good. If I have the vlog clip, I'll insert it, but I doubt I still have it. Or did I even record that part? I was so, my feelings were so mixed on these scents that I told the rep, pick me out too. Or I'm going to sit here all day and go back and forth and then end up just getting all of them, which I went back and got the rest. Yellow, so... I told you the notes, I told you the price, and let me tell you what this smells like. Carolina Herrera Good Girl. Okay, I didn't bring any strips in here today, y'all. And it's not a good week for me um, to be spraying on me. If you know me, you know what that means. I'm just not having a good, I, I think I'm just kind of tired. And I don't want all these perfume oils um, seeping into my skin. Mm-hmm. I kid you not. I kid you not. If you love this shoe, which we all do. Oh gosh, I got that on my nose. This is probably a hundred and fifty dollars. Thirty some dollars. Okay. Let's move on to the next one. So this is Grandior in a silver packaging so this one right here is my least favorite bottle because the top i think throw it off a little bit they didn't want to do silver on silver so they made the top matte but yeah so let's go over this one right here is 38 dollars as well 40 percent coupon applied at checkout if you subscribe you gotta subscribe just just disregard all that y'all so this one has notes of bergamot rose floral peach fruity amber musk patchouli and so, there are no reviews on this. This is how new these are. Oh, yes it is, yes it is, yes it is. Very sweet, good quality. To my nose, it's close to the pink shoe. Ha! Be right back. I'm just gonna tell you guys right now. What made me pick this one is because when I smelt it, I literally got Gentle Fluidy Go, but I didn't. I got like, it could be his long lost cousin. It gave me that rose vanilla, but it's not any vanilla in this. Is that giving Delina? Cause that's what that, no, the red shoe gives Delina. So, but when I got, but when I got home, I really didn't get that anymore. I started getting Stay Noir from Beyonce. And that's weird because look at the packaging. So, I need some. 
So this review said it's giving pink shoe, which is blush by Carolina Herrera. So let's see what, if I get blush from this. I don't get that. I don't get that at all. I don't get that at all. I don't even see how they got that. But I, if I had to compare it to anything, I would definitely compare it to Say Noir. Okay, it gives that rosy um, vanilla type vibe to me, even though it don't have vanilla in it. So I will say with this line, there are a couple more that I don't have, probably only like two. Um, so as I get them, I will come back in another video. So this one is Magnific. That's what it looked like right there. So this is what this bottle looked like right here. It's really, really cute, guys. So this one is 39 on Amazon. It's a dollar higher, okay? Still a very good price. So let's go ahead and see. There is mandarin orange, bergamot rose, jasmine mimosa, ylang ylang musk, patchouli vanilla, bedelbeer, and tonka up in here, guys. And let me just tell y'all why I'm super excited about this one. It literally smells like one of my all-time favorites, but I'm not going to tell y'all what yet. <laughs> now, a lot of you guys don't like what this is. This smells like to me um, because y'all say it gives old lady, but Coco Mademoiselle. There you go right there. Now, Coco Mademoiselle is that girl. It's like my favorite Chanel fragrance. Um, Y'all love Chance. I love Gabrielle Essence. Make sure the Essence is on there. But Coco, Mad Coco Mademoiselle just get it for me. And it might not look like it, but I have the Intense. I have the Light version. I have, girl, the lotion, the everything. So I don't use this one as much. But that's exactly what this smell like. So if you're a Coco Mademoiselle girly, here's you an alternative for $40, child. I'm trying to tell you. Y'all gonna listen to me or not? <laughs> so before we go into the next one, I'm gonna try to pull this picture up and see the ones that I don't have. I don't have, um, I don't have Boche Viva. Um, and I don't have Chic. So it's two of them that I do not have. So the next one I'm gonna talk about is Mystique. This is Mystique right here. This is the box. This will hit you for a whopping $40 on Amazon. $40? <laughs> Here's the bottle. You know what? You know what? I don't think I like these bottles, but the juice is worth it. They give beauty supply store to me, don't they? They give um, corner store to me, don't they? They give uh, five below or something, don't they? <laughs> uh, I hate when this is black on black, guys. Oh, I hate it. So I'm just going to spray it because I don't have what they say it smell like. That smells so freaking good. I might get it though. Okay, so this they say because I don't have I don't have anything to compare it to. I couldn't figure it out, so I googled it, and they say it smells like the land come. Let me tell you what's in it. Let me let me start there. So this has pear, bergamot, orange, tangerine, vanilla, jasmine, strawberry, passion fruit, rose, mimosa, ylang ylang, coffee, vanilla, patchouli, tonka. That's probably why all these running the same to me because don't they all like have a lot of the same notes in them? Like a lot, a lot. This is the one that a lot of people have bought though. Like it has the most reviews. They said because it went viral on TikTok. That dang on TikTok. So let me tell you what they are saying that it reminds them all of. So on here it's saying Lancome La Nou Trezor. Is that how you pronounce it? This one right here. I don't have that. This is a beautiful, beautiful scent. Beautiful, beautiful scent. Mm, 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 mm. Yes, let's move it to the next one. Let me find out our mouth is coming from the top of two. That's why they, do, they did this whole line. All right, let's move it to, we got two more. This one right here is called Catwalk. Here's the box. Catwalk has a beautiful bottle as well. It almost looked like Attitude, but it's gold. Ooh, it has like a green hint to it, right? See how, I can see how they would give cheapy 
but it's still cute. So, oh, I already know this, but like, <laughs> this is like a game. I have so much fun doing this. So, this one right here is $38 on Amazon. And they put it in the lavender family. Is that lavender I smell? I don't think so. Citrus, mandarin, orange, jasmine, lily, peach, musk, vanilla, aroxin. Like this is catwalk, right? Catwalk? Yeah, catwalk. Okay, and let's see what the reviews are saying about this. No, oh, well. They're all good. So if you are a Jadu, huh? <laughs> girl, you would love this. You would love this. You would love this. The door is gonna hit you for about 150. Is it me or the designer fragrances went up? Let me know, let me know. So one more and we'll be done. Everything will be linked below. Remember, remember that. Let's get to the last one. So I just did a little bit more research and they said that this one smells like Narcisco Rodriguez Her too, which I did have. I don't have it anymore. So, well, I don't think I ever had her, but yeah, it's in that family. And this is Grandeur, Grandeur, however you would pronounce it. So we're gonna go straight into Dazzling. This is the box right here. Ooh, I just sprayed that. This is the bottle. See, this bottle look, I don't know. What y'all think? Mmm. Mmm. So this smells like another Chanel scent. I'm not even sure I still got it, y'all. I have to look. I don't think I got it. I don't think I got it. One sick. All right, guys, I had to check because I had every single Chanel chance, the green, the pink, the brown, the orange and so all of them except the pink so tender so this smells like the original chanel though not this one chanel chance all right so that's every single last one of them guys i will link all of these below get to shopping i hope you enjoyed this video thumbs up for more and i'll see you all in my next one bye